This is the fastest and easiest way to level up the Merchant Alliance as of the latest update in Sea of Thieves. If you're new here, why not subscribe for more no-nonsense guides? And if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a like. Starting off, as soon as you spawn in, you're going to want to raise the Merchant Emissary. If you don't have this unlocked, you'll need to level up Merchant Alliance to level 15 before attempting this method. Once the flag has been raised, you will need to purchase some resources. Make sure to get everything apart from fireworks, wood crates, cannibal crates, fruit crates, and storage crates, as well as the bait crate. Once you load this on your ship, you should already be nearly halfway through to grade 2 of your emissary level. At this point, you're going to want to dive for a quest. Go to the Voyages section, Merchant Alliance, Lost Shipment, and select the Ashen Executive Lost Shipment. This particular voyage only has two routes, each with very short sail time and predictable spawn locations. When you surface from your dive, you will spawn right in front of the first clue on the journey. Keep an eye out for any blue glints in the water. These can be either clue bottles or captain's keys, which is what we are looking for. If you get neither of these items, look for the merchant barrel and still grab the clue as any progress on the quest gives you a lot of emissary rep on your way to grade 5. On your journey, stick as close to the path as possible. If you get the key, sail straight to the shipwreck and ignore all of the clues you get. The shipwreck will always spawn around Morrow's Peak Outpost, and if you get a clue for an island that is close on your journey and you do not yet have the key, what I like to do is raise my sails to slow down the ship in case I need to turn around and shoot out of a cannon and check the island. In the example you're seeing in this video, you can see I got it on the first island I checked after the initial clue. So once I picked up the key, I sail straight for the shipwreck. When you reach the shipwreck, grab everything, including kegs, as we are less than a square away from the turning point. Head over to the Sovereigns if you're on a captain ship to turn in. If not, look up at the merchants. Sell everything you gathered, but don't lower the emissary. Next, you're going to want to dive for another quest. Go to Voyages, Merchant Alliance, Raid Voyages, and select Duel with an Ashen Lord. This will take us to a Ashen Winds event already with a grade 5 merchant flag up. This is the quickest world event to complete for all crew sizes and just by using a blunderbuss and consistently reloading you will have taken down the boss in no time. Once complete you will be rewarded with a scroll of chartered waters as well as some other high tier merchant loot. This will also progress one of the new commendations for selling these items on top of providing a huge amount of levels in your merchant reputation. Head over to the closest outpost and sell everything once again. This time we want to lower the emissary flag. This doesn't provide the greatest amount of gold, however it does give you plenty of reputation in the merchant alliance. Re-raise the emissary flag and you are good to repeat this process over and over again. If you enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like and consider subscribing. And if you're looking for more Sea of Thieves content there is a video on your screen right now.